Today on Logan Lee Adventures. We're actually leaving Hoi An for a day trip and we're going to Moi Sung. And Moi Sung is built in the 4th century and it has Hinduism influence and it's basically like a whole temple sanctuary site. And to get there, we're not going by any ordinary means. We got ourselves a sit air blade. Orange for Dutch motorbike. Look at this. Look at this. Beauty. Just putting my helmet on. Ooh, I feel like a Power Ranger. to stop on this beautiful bridge on our journey look how like open and wide and there's no traffic whatsoever the view is spectacular we come on roadblock with all these cows Driving through such a peaceful village right now. Like as you can see, the roads are spotless clean here and it's just so quiet. And people are as you drive past people are smiling at you. Really, you guys have to get off the I guess out of the city and into the countryside just for this serenity really. And then in the countryside you see all these little temples along the side. Just as this gorgeous one right here. And this one next door too. I just dotted along. It's so amazing just driving through. It didn't take long until we escaped into the rural countryside outside of Hoi An. It was incredibly empty. A few villagers stretched for miles between rivers and well-maintained roads. Sites such as a man casually pulling an ox cart of bamboos, the sites of the luscious green rice farms, one after another standing vibrantly underneath the sunshine. No big houses, no big trucks or buses, no high-speed motorbikes, just buffaloes, cows, bridges, and boats. We made it to my son. Sanctuary in just about 50 minutes outside of Hoyan, out of Hoyan, as we drove through all the beautiful villages and the rice fields. But I think the choice of my son because the temple and sanctuary are in the mountains, and literally the translation is something like beautiful mountains in Vietnamese. So we have this golf cart. This free shuttle <laughs> that's driving us all the way. It's two kilometers, so it's not a short drive. Uh, all the way into the mountains to go see the sanctuaries. Thank God we didn't need the long fence. Yeah. <laughs> We then arrive to the My Son Sanctuary. My Son is a cluster of abandoned and partially ruined Hindu temples in Vietnam. Constructed between the 4th and the 14th century AD by the kings of Champa, the temples are dedicated to the worship of the god Shiva. I would have never imagined Vietnam to be so diverse and have been crossed with historic cultures. This site has been the battlefields through World War II, the First Indochina War, and especially during the Second Indochina War, many temples were damaged. 
although the Vietnamese authorities deemed mine unexploded bombs at four main monuments since 1975, this is progressing slowly and much demining work remains to be carried out still to this day. <laughs> we literally have to honk to get them out of the way. After Misan, which is the sanctuary that we were just at, it was so beautiful, especially the sun coming out uh, afterwards. But we just pit stop here in this little, I guess I would call it a mom and pop restaurant. We only have two items, two noodle dishes uh, for the evening, so we order it and we're gonna see what they're like. Because we're really hungry, we haven't ate since we left our drive. The first drive to Misan was an hour and a half going through the very beautiful villages and uh, rice paddies. But now it's nice before driving back another hour to Hoi An to get some munchies in our stomach. The version of Big Man Little Chair. <laughs> This hot pipe in bowl with quail egg with nice amount of beef, lots of green onion, and thick noodles. So good, but now we must hit the road back to Hoi An. To end my final night in Hoi An, we're back at where it all began. The Bun Me Queen. Hit subscribe if you haven't already, give this video a thumbs up and leave a comment below. Sending you lots of love from the central coast of Vietnam.